Well, I can only guess that y'all enjoyed the warrior build file video quite a lot. So like any other content creator, a second video shall be made, seeing its success. There's been quite a lot of changes to weapons anyway, so I might as well just make a second video for the warrior build regardless. Warriors were already strong to begin with, but with the introduction of the Mistral update, warriors went from server-wide concerns to universal threats. Huh? Huh? Now being able to switch and swap weapon abilities with other weapons, the movesets of just three weapons seem more customizable than magic spells. People can make terrific combinations on the stupidest weapons, like Flying Slash on a Poison Dagger, or Crushing Judgment on a Mace. But at least common sense is on the table, so you can't do something like putting Arrow Storm on a shield. Other weapon-wielding stat builds like Warlords, Conjurers, and Knights also get stronger because of this new function. But due to the recent 1.16.7 update, slow warlords like Iron Leg Warlords became actual garbage due to a nerf and slow fighting style imbuements. So I won't recommend using warlords right now, since many people like using Iron Leg for warlord builds. Anyways, here's my build. Some sunken warrior armor stuff, this Lady Karina drop, and this crystalline silver pauldrons. Crystalline specifically, for that extra attack speed, because I need a lot of attack speed. Yes, I know that stat has been nerfed, but I don't care, it's still very good. Most of the gear has candelarias on it, except for my, uh... Atlantean powerful purple Revena Apostle Folds. They have Morenses instead. But, either way, they're still really good. I, I think it's a pretty good setup, it's good enough for me. And now to the normal PvP stuff you'd see in all of these videos.
Anyways, for those that wonder what my weapons are, here's my weapons. Stun Sunken Sword with these abilities, which you get from fishing. Triasta of Bronze with these abilities, which you get from King Calvis. And Atlantean Mace, which you get from Mutated Atlanteans with these abilities. The reason for this weapon is because of the slowness debuff it gives. It's very cool. Anyways, I hope you guys liked this second video for the warrior build. If you did, hit the like button, subscribe, comment down below what your favorite stat build is, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.